This is a video demonstration of the Optimus 111B camp stove. Uh, this one happens to be embossed with the logo here, and Optimus, and then the uh, model number here. Overall, it's in very good condition. Uh, very well, some rust, but nothing major. It's got a carry handle on the back here. This one's actually fairly large when you compare it to the Optimus 8R, which I have on top here. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison. And here's the, the front latch here. As you can see, a little bit of rust there in the bottom, but nothing too significant. It's got the brass tank here. This one you actually pump. Kind of like the Coleman stoves. Here's the uh, flame adjuster. And with the Optimus logo on it. So, uh, counterclockwise to uh, clean the, the valve. And to close is uh, clockwise. And it just inserts this hole here. And fits right into here. Hard to do one-handed. There we go. So um, I've had this for about four months. Uh, I actually haven't used it at all, so this will be the first time. But let me uh, put some fuel in here, pump it up, and we'll uh, see it run. Okay, so I gave it a few pumps and uh, turned it counterclockwise because we're going to need to prime this. That releases a little bit of uh, fuel. And you can see there's like a little cup down there. So the um, fuel collects into that little cup. And then you just simply light it. You have to warm up this burner. Let's go ahead and uh, light this up here. There we go. And let the burner warm up. Once that's warmed, the generator is nice and warm, we'll turn the valve on and uh, you should get a nice uh, stove top type uh, pattern of a flame. And so the fuel in the little cup is burned off. And now the burner is starting to burn. It's a little windy here. So so we're not going to perfect view, but let's see if we can get it out of the window here. There we go. And they call this burner the roaring burner because it makes that kind of roaring noise, but uh, you can get a, uh, an aftermarket quiet burner if you want. Still got a little wind here, but you get the idea. So yeah, this probably hasn't been fired up and. Uh, 20 or 30 years, and all I did was add some fuel, let the let it set for a few minutes, uh, turn the, the valve here counterclockwise and clockwise a few times to clean the, the valve, the needle, the little jet there, and yeah, she fired right up. Pretty nice, good little stove. And this particular stove will uh, most likely be available to purchase on uh, eBay, this exact one. Thanks for watching.